What's up guys? Today I'll be showing you guys a new trick you can do on Katarina. This is called the invisible Q. Let me show you guys exactly what it looks like. So if you saw there, you can see that the animation in which you pick up your W dagger actually hides the Q animation. So what this trick is good for is it's a very useful tip you can do in lane. Um, it's good for hiding the Q so that you know it makes it less predictable for the enemy to know where the Q dagger is going to land. Because you know when you throw out your combo in lane, a lot of times when you throw out that Q, they already start juking forward. So this will make it so that it's harder for them to react immediately to your Q. And who knows, they might not even see it and you can just immediately follow up on that Q dagger afterwards. Another good thing about it is that it stalls out your Shunpo cooldown. So what I mean by that is when you do your combo, you don't throw all your skills at once. You have to wait for your W to completely drop and pick up before you throw your Q out. And what that does is that your Shunpo is slowly going off cooldown. And once you pick up that W dagger, uh, it'll be on a shorter cooldown so that you can jump in almost immediately right after. So let me let me show you what I mean. So when you eat WQ, you have that wait. You have that like small wait you have to do in order to uh, jump back onto the dagger. And during that time, the enemy has a lot of time to juke it. When you use this trick, you slow down the combo so that you can immediately use your Shunpo right afterwards. So let me show you how that looks. See how you're able to Shunpo almost immediately after you throw out your Q? So yeah, that helps in lane to kind of surprise your opponent. And this whole trick is basically to kind of hide your combo so that you're less predictable and just give them the element of surprise. And if you notice that I didn't um, put extra points into E, the only thing I have is the intelligence mastery that I use to mitigate the Shunpo nerfs that happen. I honestly think that 5 cooldown, 5% 5 cooldown is like enough. So yeah, that was the trick. Um, I hope it helps you guys a lot in your gameplay in your laning phase because I get a lot of complaints saying that you know it's hard to hit Katarina's combo because first of all the Shinpo nerves and second of all uh, people like start to, to figure out how to play around cat so they dodge the cues like pretty easily so this is a little trick that you can do in order to just mitigate the whole thing and make it a lot easier for you to hit your combo and at the same time be less predictable.